I didn't even realize I was on camera. I turned it on, but I don't know what I was looking for. Anyway, um, this video, it, well, first of all, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Jernigan Six, your middle-aged natural beauty. And um, this is a, well, one of yawn. <sighs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Okay, so this video is um, somewhat of um, an edge update. Uh, I made a video about maybe a month ago, if it was that long ago, about my edges. They're growing, uh, but they were too, too fine to actually start locking. I want to update you guys on what I did with my edges. And I also want to um, just share just my feelings that have nothing to do with locks, okay? Alright, so, okay, um, my edges. So, they, these are the two, I started two new little locks. Um, these always come out when I wash them. What I had done the first time I talked to you guys about my edges, I um, had French braided them down, made a corn roll right there. And I was actually, for this one, you see this one is a lot smaller and finer. I had I was going to uh, I was going to add a uh, I was going to put a yarn braid here, and I actually put the yarn braid on, but it got tangled in my hair, and then when I tried to take it out, part of my hair came out with it. So that let me know that this part, my edges are not to be extended. And you can see the fine gray hairs in here. I have no problem with that. You know, even when you color your hair, depending on what color you use, the gray will come back quickly. And once it, you know, once this fills in and all of it, it gets really thick, it's okay. You know, it'll be okay. I want my salt and pepper. I told you guys that before, but it's just that um, the process of growing the salt and pepper is, is even... Uh, more time consuming there's a much longer waiting process than growing your locks and I don't mean totally salt and pepper but I mean like growing my edges in here so anyway yeah so yeah here are my little my little locks my babies and I'm just waiting for them to mature I know I'm gonna to have to continue to um, to uh, keep braiding them back up once they come out okay and what's going on here is um, you guys saw the last video I did my 15 month log update um, yeah my hair was curled but it had started falling I didn't put anything on on me on these little pin curls I didn't put any solution or anything on it I just want to kind of keep the bump um, cause when I go to bed, I just put my hair in a satin bonnet, just push it up in there and keep it moving. So yeah, but I just didn't want these to fall too much. So I put a little, uh, pink curl there. Okay. Now what I'm getting ready to talk about is, um, just something I noticed in my feed on YouTube. Uh, and I think I'm getting ready to unsubscribe to a lot of people because, the negativity on YouTube regarding um, African Americans and well, Afri us. And I'm not going to say them. I'm going to say us. This, this, all, every time I turn on a video, I just see some crazy stuff. Every time I look at my feed, I see violence. I see negativity between the genders. I just see so much unhealthy, um, just, just crazy stuff. You know, I can't even think of the word that I'm looking for right now. But, you know, when I'm back in the day, I'm not going to say I perpetuated or even played a part in a bunch of the negativity. A lot of my videos were probably perceived as negative. But they were coming from a, a different place. I never meant for anything to be negative. Um, yeah, but I I am um, I see people that are 
at a at an age in life that you would think they would be at a different stage in life and to see these people maybe if you're 10 years younger than me I'm middle aged you know I'm I'm let's say I'm past 40 I'm out of my 40s okay so you see people my age or even just a little bit I mean in the mid 40s still making videos attacking another person and and just talking about dumb street crap and I mean it's like when in the heck are you gonna grow up you know and this is just my opinion you guys can flag this video if you want to I don't give a damn and and, and just just you know it's just crazy it's just crazy so um if a lot of you guys especially um, I see it more in in the young men that I'm I'm subscribed to. I gotta go. I, I I'm I'm I just don't want to see all that and hear all that. You know, I have a son that's that's uh, a young man with a young family, and I listen to him, and we have conversations, and you know, and and I'm not putting my son up on the pedestal because Lord knows he's not perfect, but. I can say that, you know, at least to my knowledge, he don't participate in all that type of negativity and all that. What he will do is um, acknowledge who he really is, what he's done in life, and focus on all the good things, you know, in life. Anyway, you guys, that's just a mini rant. But if, if you guys, especially you young men or you even middle-aged men out there uh, with all this craziness, you know, um, if you don't see me commenting on your videos anymore, not that it even matters. But, I mean, it, it, there comes a time in your life. you you got to be an example of what you're talking about. And right now, I, I just don't see it. So... Anyway, um, I could go on forever because I'm very passionate about what I'm saying. Uh, I could go on forever. I, there's a lot more points I would probably like to make, but I'm going to save my energy for something more positive and something more productive. You guys have a wonderful evening, and God bless you.